welcome to today's video so in this video i'm going to do an exciting video and that is a beginner's guide on imovie so i hope you guys enjoy this video let's get into this video so as you can see over here here is the app imovie so let's go into the app if you don't have the app you can go download it in the app store so let's just go in the app store and say imovie here we'll see imovie and it is for free so you can just download it the size of iMovie is 567.6 megabytes, so it's not that much. So do yourself a favor and download this app. Okay, so we have the app, so let's get into the app. So what we're gonna do on this screen, we're gonna start getting ready to edit our video. So we're gonna press this plus button to create a project, and then we're gonna say movie. So we're gonna create a movie. So I have an album right here, my YouTube album. So I'm gonna in, and then I'm gonna select my main video that I'm gonna be using to edit on. And it is this one that is 11 minutes and 12 seconds long. So I'm gonna click on that and then we're gonna edit. So then you say create movie. Okay, so now we have our video clip over here. So now let's look at the basics on this screen you have right here. So over here, if you click done, you go out of your project. The plus button is to add stuff to your video. This is the play video and pause so button, undo button, and here is just some settings that you can play with. So let's, I'm going to add my intro video to this video. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to press the plus button. Go to albums, to my YouTube album, then I'm going to insert my intro video. So then when I press on this video, I'm going to click on the plus to add it. So in this video, I'm going to show you. Okay, so what I don't like what just happened now is you can see here is a transition option. So if you click on it, you will see it is faded, but I just want it to be right to the next video. I don't want it to fade, so I'm just going to say none. So if you want it to fade or if you want the theme, dissolve, slide, whatever you want, but I just want none. So if you press on your main video, on the bottom you will see there is split, detach, duplicate or delete. So there is where you can split your video or you can use this to trim it. Then you can change the volume of your video over here. There's also just a quick split. Then here is where you can speed up your video or slow it down or you can freeze it. The next one is to add a text. Text make videos so fun. So here is a few options for you there you can so see here. the text so i'm just gonna say none and then over here you can add filters to your video so comic none ink black and white so here you can see there are a bunch of options so now you just can go roughly and split and edit out the parts you don't want in your video. That is for me the first thing to do, the basic thing to clean out your video with all the content you don't want to be in there, like stuff you said wrong or silent moments or just parts that you don't want included in your video. So just go ahead and edit that out. Okay, so the next thing we're going to do is add just like a PNG or something. So over here you will see I said about the notes widget. So right here I'm gonna click the plus button and I'm gonna add this little arrow. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna press on the three dots and say picture in picture. So there we'll see there is my arrow so i'm gonna click on it and adjust it a bit so over here you will see these options so here you can move it and i'm just gonna make it bigger it just makes it very difficult to see what you are doing and then you can also pinch and zoom in to make your timeline a bit longer 
so then you can edit how long you want it to be so I'm gonna let it be like this okay so let's add a text so we're gonna be talking about the notes app so I'm gonna press and I'm gonna say press this T to add a text let's see which one I want I'm just gonna say standard then I'm gonna press on text and say edit so I'm gonna say notes so then we're just gonna press on the top one and say edit and then I'm gonna just delete that text delete that text so now it is just this so you can drag it and drop it where you want it to be so then it will look like this add them to your home screen so here I have okay so if you want to edit your text you can edit it down here here you can select the AA and then you can choose a font that you want or you can change the color or if you press on the three dots here you can change the style there is just a lower and a default there you can choose if you want your text to have a shadow sound effects you can add add them to your home screen or you can say full clip duration so then it will be there in the entire clip so let's just move it back Okay, so now we have split our video, we have added text to our video, we have maybe selected a filter, we have inserted our clips, our intros and our outros. At the end I say please subscribe to my channel and remember to click the bell button. So now I'm going to add a video clip over my video. So what we're going to do is you press the plus button and here I have that screen recording I took a while back. So then I press on the three dots and I say picture in picture again. Then I just drag to where I want this clip to be. I want it to be here at the end. So let's make this a bit bigger. Okay, so I'm gonna have it like this. Then you can have the volume down. Which you like the most. Please subscribe to our channel, that will really help us so much. And remember to click the bell notification button to get any notifications when you upload a video. Okay, just like that. So now I'm gonna just add my outro. Okay, so now I've added my outro. Okay, bye! There you can see my outro is added. To add a green screen to your video is if you press the plus button, here I have a subscribe green screen. So if I press on that, I'm going to click on the three dots and say green blue screen. Here you can see, here is my green screen. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. It you is really fun to add widgets to your phone. It just out. makes it so much more fun. So it's as easy as that to add a green screen. It's always like, how do I add a green screen? So professional, but it is just so easy. Okay, so we have split our video. We have added our intro and outros. We have added text to our videos. We've inserted clips to our videos. So we have done so much to our video. You can also just go and download from the internet some green screens that you can use in your video so you can add so much stuff to add to your video if you like for instance this one here you can add just a home screen over there which i have just a random to video to if you're clicking something and you can add audios to your video now we're gonna add some background music to our video so that it's not that quiet so what we're gonna do is you press the plus button there you can see audio so you can go to my music or soundtracks or sound effects there is also that you can choose a bunch of from okay so let's go to soundtrack and let's choose a soundtrack for our video so you can see here is pop songs, playful songs, chill, sentimental, retro. I'm gonna go with chill. I'm 
going to add this one so then you're going to click the plus button and then on the bottom you will see it is adding your so i'm just going to split it at the end of my video because i'm just going to turn the sound off here at the beginning of my video so that it doesn't mess around with my intro's music video so in this video i'm going to show you some so that is about how simple it is to edit on iMovie but it is great for when you are starting to edit your videos and just keep on going when creating your videos. The key is just to keep going and to not stop. So now that we are done editing our video, what you're going to do is you're going to say press done on the top. Then you're going to click the share button down here and then you're going to say save video. So now it's exporting your video and then it's going to save to your camera roll. Okay, so now we go to photos, recent. So here you can see the video is done exporting. So now you can post your video on YouTube or use it for personal use, whatever you want to do with your video. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Feel free to leave a comment down below. Please subscribe to our channel, that will really help us so much and remember to click the bell notification button to get any notifications when we upload a video. I hope you guys have a lucky day. Bye!